Alrighty, fellas and fellettes, I got an extra, extra large iBuddy seat cover here. I gotta take my dogs to the vet, alright, and uh, get their shots updated, so I figured this would be a good time to do this video. Now, what this video is gonna be all about is how well does this extra, extra large iBuddy backseat pet cover fits, alright? So, I'm gonna show how it fits. And then we'll show the dogs using it, and then that'll be it, all right? So you get a little understanding on how well it fits. And I guess we could go over how well it's constructed, right? We don't want something that is going to fall apart too easy. We know our pets can tear stuff up, right? I got two pit bulls, so yeah, it better work pretty well, okay? Hot damn, let's get some. Alrighty, getting the box open. It looks like it comes with a nice little carrying case. Um... Uh, my first guess is I'm gonna have a hard time putting it back in after I got it out. Alright. Alrighty, dudes and dudettes. First things first, I see right away because this was in my mind. How, how well constructed are these straps? Now, when I was looking at it on Amazon, they didn't look like this. It looked a little cheaper. I'm kind of impressed it doesn't look so cheap and feel so cheap. So, this is gonna be a good start already. Now, this material right here. I'm hoping doesn't kind of like dry rot and fall apart. The rest of it seems pretty, pretty good. This material here, material that's going to lay on your seat, seems to be pretty good. Alright, so it seems to be fitting pretty good so far. Go ahead and continue on. Very easy to install. You really shouldn't need too much help. Hardy bits. I have the thing totally upside down. Alright, so make sure you all read the instructions. Uh, before you get gone, okay? So uh, now I'm gonna go ahead and put it in the right way. I guess this little material goes up. Uh, and you got these little dilly dallies that go tucked down in the seat right here, these handles. Uh, and I should have should have read the instructions. All right, now I am, and I'll get it right. Alrighty. That's it right there. Stupid easy to install. You got a mesh net so they can see you. You can see them. Some storage. All right, the side zip up. I don't know if I want that right there. My dogs are pretty heavy. They're probably going to snap that little piece off, which is going to make me kind of angry. All right, so everything fits nice. My bunny. I'm saying stupid easy to install, and I have more room to play so that's pretty good so these seats can go forward not everybody has their seat so far back like i said i got a taller family and this thing came with this uh little strap like my dogs don't like to stay still so that's pretty cool stay in the back and stay still okay so this side can also zip up here Hang, hang, and you can zip it. Zoop. Zoop. There you go. Animal cargo area without ruining your really nice vehicle. All right? You pay a lot of money for them. You don't want to beat them up, right? Right. It's not a, this is not a farm truck. Okay? This is a truck for my family and myself, and I like them to stay pretty nice. If I had an old used beat up truck, I really wouldn't worry about it too much, but I don't really have any old used beat up trucks, all right? So, until then, I like to keep them nice. All right, buddy, extra, extra large. I'll leave a link in the description. All right, now next, we'll show the dogs in there. Probably gonna embarrass me, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Here we go. Say hello. Let's go get your shots. Go get your shots updated. Yeah. One of them scratched me real good. And I got blood all in my brand new truck now. I don't know if you can see that. I'm trying to drive right now. I know. Uh, not a good idea to not pay attention. Yep, works. Here they are. I got this one right here strapped in and you know that seat belt buckle thing I showed you because he likes to jump up front and he don't need to be up front like I said you don't need to be ruining my truck boy you don't need to be ruining none of the cars or trucks 
or whatever. You already ruined the house. You need to sit down. Ooh, I'll be hot down. Well, that's it right there, I right, buddy. There's my other car right there. It's behind me. The Benzo. The other truck is in the shop getting fully forged from head to toe. Hot damn. Well, a hot damn we made it here. Yeah. Stay together. <laughs> <laughs>